Hey hons, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hi, I'm back and I have new teeth. <laughs> so this video is gonna be really short and I'm just gonna get right into it. What I have are called composite bondings and I got them done with Alexandra Dental in their new clinic in Claremaris. A lot of people told me, you don't need anything done with your teeth. You had braces for two years, you're grand. But making videos like this all the time, I have to look at myself a lot. And just over time, I got really self-conscious of them. They were perfectly straight because I did have braces, but they weren't all kind of the same shape tooth. I had my canines were a bit pointier than I would have liked them. And the teeth either side, my front teeth were considerably shorter than my two front teeth. So I just felt that they could have been better, you know? So when I heard Alexandra Dental was coming to Clamaris, I was so excited because a load of my friends had been to them in Limerick. So I knew they had a really good reputation. And I inquired about like what could be done to my teeth. I knew veneers were hell expensive, so I probably wasn't gonna be getting those and I knew that composite bondings were a thing but I didn't really know what they were so I just made an inquiry and from that they offered me a collaboration and to get my teeth done and then to inform all you guys all about it so you'll know because now we all want it as well. <laughs> so veneers are quite expensive I'm not sure on the exact amount but I know they can be like thousands a tooth so I'm just listen I'm not on that kind of budget like I couldn't have been I couldn't be doing that personally um, and I didn't want to shave down my natural teeth at all I have six composite bondings on the front six teeth on the top and then I had a little gap on one of my bottom tooth and she like filled that up for me as well so people got really scared because they thought they were like veneers did you have to get your teeth shaved down no definitely not it's just like if you have a chip in your tooth and you go in and they kind of put filling on it and mold it back up that's literally what she did for all of my teeth. They're just like filling, added onto the ends and then blended up and molded to change the shape of the tooth and to get rid of any gaps in your teeth or discoloration or anything like that. So that was one of the questions I got asked a lot. Another question I got asked a lot was, did it hurt? No, not a bit. I think I was in the chair for like two, two and a half hours and it wasn't sore at all. Like it didn't hurt, it wasn't painful, but as you would be if you were sitting in a place for two hours with your mouth open and people kind of poking at you. It was a little uncomfortable, but you know, if you're sitting down for two hours, you're gonna get uncomfortable anyway. So it was uncomfortable, but it wasn't sore. Like it wasn't sore at all. If anyone has ever been for like a clean or like a checkup or that, like where they're just kind of like polishing your teeth and stuff like that, that's all it felt like. Like you could feel them going at your teeth, but it didn't hurt, okay? so. Yeah. So when I went in originally, I discussed with Brie Joke, like basically what I wanted done with my teeth. I was like, this is what I don't like about them. And she, like I showed her pictures of stuff that I kind of did like more that I thought that I could do. And then we were discussing how it would work on my teeth and everything like that. And because you're getting basically kind of fillings on the ends of your teeth, it's going to have to be colored. So they're going to have to shade match it to your teeth. So you're going to want to whiten your teeth most likely because obviously you want to have the nice whiter smile but you can. So whitening kits, I think are around 200 euro. You can double check that on Alexandra Dental's page. The teeth whitening part of this was actually gifted to me through PR. So I took that home with me and um, you get a little tray. I think I have clips of me doing it. So I'll try to insert them here. Please do not look at the state of me. This is probably like a really late at night or really early in the morning. And, um, but you get like a little, if anyone has ever had braces and you have a retainer, it's like that, but it's a softer kind of a material. It's bendy, it's comfortable, it's not, it's not hard. Um, you get that and you get like a little syringe with whitening gel in it and you put a little teardrop in each tooth in the retainer thing and I had to put some sensodyne toothpaste in it as well because my teeth went so sensitive the first time I did it I left it in for hours and hours okay way longer than you're meant to I was told leave it in for 30 and I left it in longer so yeah um and I had to get Nurofen for the pain and I had to buy Sensodyne and as soon as I got the Sensodyne and started putting it into the trays which Brie Dog advised me to do the sensitivity went away and it was grand and then I was grand so I teeth whitened for about three weeks and because my teeth were so sensitive I only did it like every like two or three days. You can do it like every single night. You can do it every other night. It's just kind of what works for you. So I did it, I think for around three weeks and I did it every couple of nights while I was watching Love Island. <laughs> I'd say I noticed a difference in the teeth whitening after two to three goals. Obviously you do the first one, you take it out and you're like looking, but it's the same as going to the gym, doing 10 sit-ups and coming home and looking at your belly. You're not gonna notice a difference in the first try. Maybe you will, but I didn't. It took two or three goals for me to really see a difference. And like people were saying it to me. 
So that's how I, I know it. it definitely worked. I loved the teeth whitening, it was good. I would do it again. I think you have to kind of do some teeth whitening every couple of months, like maybe twice a year. Um, because through tea and everything like that, your teeth are gonna get stained. So when I brought my teeth shade up, then I went back and then we got the camps of bonding underway. So I was back in the chair. I don't know the ins and outs of what happens because I'm not a dentist and I wasn't watching them doing it. I just closed my eyes and I was, you know, just singing away to myself in my head, basically. That's what I did to pass the time. Nicki Minaj, super base. They kind of put separators in through your teeth. They, I'm sure they prime your teeth and then they put on the filling and they blend it up and they cure it with like a UV light and then they kind of polish it after and you know, make sure there's no rough surfaces and everything like that. It's literally like getting acrylic nails but on your teeth. Do you know, it's all the same steps, the priming, the UV, the shaping. That's literally the best way I can describe it to you. So yeah. When I first got them done, it was a massive like shock. They were, they weren't exactly what I have now. They were a bit longer and they were more full. I'll put in the picture of them here. I did really like them, but it just, they were very like fake looking on me and I don't think the shape of them suited my face entirely. Um, but when you do go to get them, you get a revision appointment the next week. So you go back and if you wanna make any changes or anything, obviously because they're your teeth and you know, they have to suit your face and everyone is different. So when I went back, which was literally today, I went for my revision appointment. Um, I just asked pretty joke to make them a little more natural looking and put some curves around each kind of tooth, like the way a tooth naturally would be because my own teeth were like that and my bottom ones are like that. So I felt like they didn't quite match the bottom. But now, hello. These are the teeth of my dreams, I swear to God. I love them. I feel so much more confident now. They don't feel, they feel absolutely like normal teeth. That's how they feel, they feel grand. I'm like running my tongue over them, like. They just feel fab, I love them. I don't have sharp kind of canines or fangs as I used to think I had before. Um, and they're all kind of the same length and all even, but not too fake looking. They, I think they look really natural now and they look like these are literally just my teeth. You just wouldn't know, it's brilliant. Because I wear a retainer most nights because I had braces, I have to get a new retainer fitted. So I'm going next week to get my impressions from a new retainer because obviously my old one won't fit me anymore. <laughs> they last four to six years, I think, is like the general kind of run time for them and then you can get them replaced. Or if you earn more money when you're older, you could look into getting veneers if that is really like what you want. Like I think it's just personal kind of preference, isn't it? So I don't know. I don't know what I'll be doing in five years or whenever I have to get them changed or whatever. You never know how long they last you, so yeah. I'm happy with them. I don't know if I have anything else to say on them. Good dental hygiene, that's fairly obvious. You have to look after them, do you know what I mean? Pricing, 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 pricing. I think obviously that was the main question people had because like teeth are expensive, okay? You only get one set of teeth in your life. And if you ruin them, they're ruined forever. Like you can get all these dental implants and stuff like that, but like they're not your teeth, teeth, do you know? So these are still my teeth. These are not fake teeth, they're still my teeth. They just have a bit of filling to fill any gaps or change the shape of them, do you know? But they're still my teeth. This was part of a collab, so I'm not sure what the total cost would be because mine were discounted. But from looking at the prices on the Alexandra Dental Instagram page, they start at like 100, 150 per tooth. If it's just a chip, it'd be like 90 but it's something that you yourself have to go in and get a consultation for to go over um, what it is gonna cost you, how many, cause you might think you need uh, this many, but you might actually need more or less, like just depending on your teeth or they mightn't be for you at all. Like everyone's teeth are different. So I can't tell you how much it's gonna cost you. You'll have to go in and get a nice consultation with Bridget Ogunisa. They're lovely there in the clinic in Clermaris or there's one in Shannon and there's one in Limerick as well, if you're kind of from those localities. So I think that's it boys and girls. So yeah, that's everything about my teeth. So I'm gonna go now, but I'm gonna leave you with some clips. Give them a follow on Instagram. If you're from Clermaris, that Clermaris Agricultural Show next weekend, Alexandra Dental are actually gonna have a stand there and you can get 75% off their teeth whitening, which is insane. I don't know how much that is because I'm not good at maths, but that is a decent amount off anything, Jesus. <laughs> that is all I have for you today, huns, but I will be back with another video next week. My dissertation is nearly done. I'm nearly free for life again. Life is for living and I'm nearly living my best one again, so, 
yeah new videos to come get excited like this video if what i said was helpful or if you are thinking about getting composite bonding or composite veneers or anything like that leave a like if you have any more questions comment down below and yeah give the alexandra gentle page a follow and message them if you have genuine inquiries and i'll see you in my next video goodbye hums <laughs>